Another bear sighting today, this time in Centennial. The bear was in a busy neighborhood near the streets of South Glen Shopping Center. Dozens of deputies searched through backyards. 7 News reporter Jennifer Kovaleski spoke to the man who first spotted this bear. Well, it's pretty exciting to have like a zoo in your backyard here. It was an all out manhunt for this black bear in Centennial. I'm running if he comes over the fence, okay? <laughs> Taking the kids with me. Neighbors woke up to the sounds of helicopters and deputies searching their backyards. Totally caught off guard by a police officer looking over the fences. It's really cool. They don't want to go to school this morning or have breakfast. Rob Dow first spotted the bear in a tree in his backyard early this morning. He took this photo of him. I could see a silhouette. He was pretty, pretty interested in me. Uh, it was kind of alarming. At around 7 a.m., the bear disappeared. Despite searching high and low for nearly two hours, deputies couldn't find him. Our yards are so lush and green here, it's really hard to find anything. <laughs> Just before 9, deputies finally captured the sneaky bear and were able to safely tranquilize him. I think it's unfortunate, but it's pretty cool. That neighbors get to see this. We don't get to see this come down into the city too often. A dramatic end to an otherwise exciting morning in Centennial. Jennifer Kovaleski, 7 News. Now, deputies think this bear could be the same one that was seen earlier this week. And like all the bears we've seen this year, and there have been a lot of them, he was looking for food. Experts say there's a food shortage, which is why we're seeing so many bears so close to homes.